Well, Thanksgiving just three days away, and if you're hitting the road to get to Grandma's house, you are not alone. Triple A says it will be the busiest Thanksgiving travel week in nearly a decade. XY4 is Brittany Paris working for you with some tips to save you some sanity while heading out this holiday weekend. Brittany. Nadine, snowy, rainy, mm -hmm. foggy conditions can be downright scary to drive in if you're not prepared. And while we might not be in for a winter storm just yet, if you're traveling this holiday, get ready for an array of weather. For some, nothing says Thanksgiving like honking horns or long TSA lines. This year, AAA projects more than 48 million people will travel to their Turkey Day destination. And if you're hitting the highway, you'll be one of 43.5 million people on the road. But before you drive off into holiday happiness, make sure you're prepared. The Washington State Department of Transportation says leave with a full tank of gas, a cell phone charger, and water and snacks. Make sure you have jumper cables, flares, and warm clothes in your car. And don't forget a flashlight, ice scraper, or tire chains, especially if you're traveling over passes. Check the weather before your trip to see if Mother Nature will affect your drive. WSDOT has holiday travel charts for highways and mountain passes throughout the state. They also have a mobile app you can download by searching WSDOT. And don't forget about Washington 511. It gives you statewide travel information. And this weekend, all eyes will be on Martin Stadium for Apple Cup 2016. No matter which route you're taking, there are only a few ways to get to Pullman. DOT says drivers should expect congestion on US 195 and State Route 27 between Spokane and Pullman, and State Route 26 between Vantage and Colfax both before and after the game. The best advice? Slow down. No game, no, not even the Apple Cup, is worth crashing. And planning your trip and knowing alternative routes ahead of time could help ease frustration and minimize delays. To stay safe, the National Safety Council asks you to designate not only a sober, but a rested and focused driver. For links to all of those resources, head to my Facebook page just by searching Brittany Paris KXY. In studio tonight, I'm Brittany Paris, KXY4 News. Thank you, Brittany.